So you might be in a situation where for some reason WhatsApp, the backup and the restore options are just not working. Now, what does this mean? Well, basically, when you first set up WhatsApp, you might be able to restore your messages. But if you try to go through, you might actually see that those messages that are being restored are no longer actually restoring. So if you back the messages and they're not restoring, that may be causing issues, but you may also have issues if you're trying to back up your messages and it's not allowing you to back up. That can also be another thing that can cause some issues here as well. So the very, very first thing you're going to want to do is you want to go ahead and make your way over to your app store. So click on your app store icon right there. And what you're going to want to do here is you want to go ahead and search up WhatsApp. So it's a very, very basic thing. Just go and search up WhatsApp just like so. And what we're going to want to do here is we want to go ahead and update our WhatsApp application. For a majority of people out there, you probably you probably have already installed WhatsApp via the App Store, unless you're using the web browser component on your you know Mac or PC, whatever you have. But on your iPhone or Android, whatever device you have, every single device out there has WhatsApp capability. So go and tap on here, click on Update, and that could very well end up fixing the problem too. Now, if that doesn't end up fixing it, the other thing you may want to try doing is actually restarting your device. So what you're going to want to do here is you want to go and hold down the volume up button and the power button on the side, and you want to go ahead and power down your phone. You want to give it a few moments, and what you're going to want to do is you want to go ahead and power it back on. Chances are probably for a ton of people out there, as long as that backup you know, file that you have hasn't been corrupted in any way, simply just going through restarting the device and then basically you know reinstalling, you know going through and trying to restore that backup is probably going to end up fixing it. If that's still not working, you may just have to delete the WhatsApp application, give it a few minutes, reinstall it, and that might end up fixing it for you too. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button on me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.